Hey guys, so we are on our way to go dress shopping with Dana for her big day next year. We got Heather here with us. We got Woo -woo. Dana's mom. Hi. And, and Jessica. Uh -oh. You ready, Dana? I am. I am slightly nervous. I thought I was going to have bubble guts this morning. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious. No, she do have bubble guts. Let me tell you. No, no, I don't off. have bubble guts. No, she had the bubble guts. That's why she couldn't make herself no coffee. She was scared to eat them eggs. <laughs> tell the truth, Dana. I was scared to eat the eggs because I see the way my stomach is set up. Mm -mm. They'll be to ram me out of there. So, I don't know about my banana. She eats while we all starve. Well, I starve because I can't. You want half of my banana? Uh uh. Sure. No, that's really gonna mess my stomach up. I brought me some snacks too. You want some fruit stuff? No, I'm good. Look, Jessica said nuts give you gas too, and that Dana don't need that. Mm -hmm. Everything gives me gas. Jessica knows that. My stomach does not work right. Mm -hmm. This is too much to put on this vlog. <laughs> no, it <isn't> even. <laughs> this is too much personal information. Even when you were little, you was the farthest child. Oh, well, that's okay. <laughs> This is all natural. People know we tell it like it is. That's right. We have no shame in our game. I know, because I'm the same way, though. Yeah, so this should be an interesting trip. Hopefully, we make it to her trying on some clothes if she don't stay in the bathroom all day. I'm not going to the bathroom. Not only, I can't get comfortable in public restrooms. Oh, my gosh. So, so you Because I need to sit down, and I can't sit down because crabs jump. And I don't want to jump it. Yeah. Say hi, guys. So we are in Davis Bridal right now, waiting for uh, Dana to come out. Hey guys, so we just left the first bridal shop and we think that we found the dress, but we're just not sure yet. So we're on our way to our second appointment. Well, I started crying. I'm the mom, so oh, mothers cry Lord. when they see their daughters in the perfect wedding dress. Even so I'm guilty. <laughs> yep, so we're on our way to the next bridal shop and we'll see y'all in there, hopefully. We are now at the restaurant about to eat. About to get some meat. Starving. Yes. So we are all done dress shopping. Right? I hope so. We hungry, y'all. We hungry. It's exhausting. 
Yeah, but I think that we done found the dress. I think we're done. I reckon so. Oh Lord, just been this high reckon so. But right now we are at where's that Hudson Grill in yeah. East Blip, Atlanta. So how was your first experience? It was good. It wasn't overwhelming. I cried like a baby, which I'm sure you guys will see. And it's all because of these two right here. <laughs> and then she started it. Toya started it next. But it was good. It was fun. Um, the second experience was hot. I got stuck in a dress. <laughs> y'all. <Yo. laughs> they called about five people to come get her out it this dress. Five, I'm just though. letting y'all know. It wasn't five. It was two plus me makes three. It was not five. <laughs> y'all, it was bad. I had to lay down on the floor and they had to hold me so they could no. pull the dress over my head. Oh my God, no. My boots went go over the boning part of it. Are you serious? She came so you can step in. I can step in so I can get it over. She said, the lady, the owner of the store came in and she said, what size bra you wear? And I told her and she said, mm. <laughs> she slightly threw shade. <laughs> but I got stuck. Yeah. But it was fun. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Did, we, did we call that or did we not call that? Oh my gosh. It is, it is, it is gorgeous on you.